What's going on everybody? I'm YouTube's Popey JN. Um, I just wanted to sit down and talk today. Um, I posted on Facebook a couple of days back on my personal Facebook, not on the Popey JN one, that I received an award, um, which I have somewhat mixed feelings with, which is kind of what I want to talk about. But um, I'll show you. So this is the award. It's a lovely award for the sale of over 50,000 records for the Capitals Born Again album, which I produced. Now, while I'm incredibly proud of that achievement, it also brings up some weird feelings. It brings up some weird feelings because it, um, I don't know, it was a very turbulent <laughs> two years because there was two albums that we did back to back. Um, and it, it feels weird celebrating that, that part of my life in a weird way. The other thing it kind of brings up was there's a song on the album, on that second album, the Born Again album, um, called Goodbye. I never was a perfect person, never had a perfect life, probably could have made things better, guess I never really tried. It's the final song on the album, and I love that song. But I've only been able to listen to that song, like, a handful of times since we did that. And it was weird kind of getting the award around this time of year. Because the person that played piano on that song was a good friend of mine, Daniel Kaya, who a lot of people will remember from Syndigo. If you ever watch Syndigo, he was a brilliant musician. And um, around this time, I think of him a lot. Because uh, in September, mid-September, it marks four years since he, he took his own life. And it just, I don't know. I've got a lot of mixed feelings. I'm proud of it. But at the same time, it brings up some weird memories, some turbulent memories. Um, but it also kind of makes me remember how fortunate I've been. It also kind of maps out for me how fortunate this journey has been with what we're building here. Because believe it or not, it was kind of Daniel that pushed me into this. You know, he really pushed the editing style that I'm now doing. It took me a couple of years to get there and kind of refine it, but he really pushed that editing style that I'm now kind of doing with all the gameplay. And it was him that kind of was looking at it when I was about to quit and went, no, keep doing it because you've got something. So I don't know. There's a lot of weird, weird mixed feelings around this time of year. And there's a lot of weird mixed feelings with that kind of being sitting on my wall. Because part of me doesn't really feel like I deserve it in a way. I guess. It's also weird because like in terms of the band, like the band's no longer together. You know, they had three albums. So two that I did and then there was one that I wasn't attached to. And then it all kind of fell to pieces, which was really sad. It, it just feels weird. I'm grateful for it, but at the same time, I'm a little bit... Do I really deserve it? I don't know. I've just been reflecting the last couple of days on my experience of it, of uh, this channel, where this channel has kind of gone in the last couple of years. It's, I, it's just made me reflect a little bit on why I do what I do. Which is always a good thing to kind of re-establish, but that's why I've kind of taken a day or two off here and there, was because it's kind of just been going around in my mind to kind of reassess those things. But it made me realize that this year we're on a good path. We're on a good path. A happier path. Um, and hopefully, in terms of content, a more enriched content path. So, I just wanted to say hi, wanted to say g'day, see how everyone's doing, 
kind of show off the award a little bit, but not too much because I, I, as I said, I'm a little bit weird feelings with it. But um, thank you guys for being part of the community. Thank you guys for sticking with me. And I'll see you guys either tomorrow or I might take another day off to kind of reflect. But um, I'll see you either today or tomorrow. Today. Either tomorrow or the next day with some new content.